<clears throat> okay, so um, the second session that I, I wanted us to just touch on um, your assignment, your assignment um, that you had. Um, and um, I'm just revising the assignment for somebody who got 100%, so shout out to him. Um, and all I really want to just bring to your attention is that, guys, you needed to have the formulas inside the cells for your answer. So basically that right there. Whenever I clicked on one of your cells, I needed to have that there. And that's where a lot of you who maybe didn't pass or didn't do well, that was where you slipped up. So here you can see all the answers here. Um, he used the formulas in order to arrive at his at his at his um, answer. Okay, there you can see again. Okay, then obviously overall cost. Again, you can see he used the answer over there. Uh, so he used formulas, formulas. Okay, so that was question one. Question uh, this question you can see again he's using formulas here and here. And then here, it was just about filling in the information. So there you didn't need to use formulas for those two, well, those four answers, okay? Question three, again, with the mark percentage, uh, uh, with the mark percentage, you need to use formulas for that as well. To get this average, all these averages, you need to use formulas. To get all these, you need formulas again. Okay, so we needed to see that you were using the Excel formulas, not doing the actual calculations on your uh, calculators or elsewhere. Okay, here again, this was just you need to fill in the actual uh, amount, then calculate the contributions ratio using formulas again. Okay, and then over here, formulas again to calculate the profit for each of them okay and then also here you can see here there was no mark because it wasn't uh, it was already given to you and here you can see formulas were applied again here even formulas was applied again you see so that's what you needed to do there here George that yeah um, and then also here formulas again Okay, so pretty, it wasn't tough. It was just you needed to hear, um, obviously, you see, is using formulas again, just converting them, obviously, into percentages, you see. Go to six, here you are using the data provided in order to produce the right charts. So what were we marking here? We were looking at, did you correctly title it? All right, did you get the right amounts? Okay, um, here, same thing. It was only a pie chart here, and here you had a, 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 a bar graph here. And then for here, it's not displaying, but here you had a histogram. It's a bar graph without any gaps, basically. Okay, and that was your assignment, okay? All right. Otherwise, guys, I believe that um, should at least give you an indication on what you needed to do. Um, Again, I'm sure you can see it really wasn't rocket science. It was really just about the formulas for a lot of you guys. Um, but otherwise, you all had the right answers for the most part. Very, uh, very few of you failed to get the right answers. It was just an issue of you didn't actually include the formulas. Okay. That said. Guys, you've been doing really well this semester. Keep up the hard work. Let's uh, grind it out and pass these more uh, exams and then move on to whatever semester two has for us.